Hey folks, it's Cyan Prepper here. And uh, we're out, and this is for the Thanksgiving Black Friday sales. And obviously one of the places we're at is Gander Mountain. And I want to do a couple pieces to this video. Number one, Gander Mountain is a great place to pick up some stuff uh, if you're a prepper. Uh, they have wonderful sales, up to 70% on certain items. Uh, so I do want to talk about that a little bit. But more importantly, I'm going to talk about how crazy this is and uh, what we can learn from Black, Black Friday as a prepper. And specifically, um, though we're a little bit early to Gander Mountain, uh, you know, waiting for some sales, we were at other lo locations like Walmart, Target uh, today, and people were literally fighting over videotapes, or I'm sorry, over uh, CDs and DVDs. They were fighting over Xboxes. They were fighting um, over other things such as waffle makers, which were $2.49. The point being is, these people were in line, uh, they had gotten early, you know, here early to, to buy some stuff, and they were fighting over items that did not really help contribute uh, to the physical well-being of anybody. You know, if you have a DVD of Bambi, that's not going to allow you to survive in any SHIT situation. So one of the biggest points being, you know, what I saw is as a prepper, it's good to go out on Black Friday, at least from my perspective, and watch how these people react. Because if they react insanely over a, a DVD, what in the heck are they going to do when they have no water? What in the heck are they going to do when they have no food? You got it. They are going to act significantly worse, uh, almost to the point where you know violence is going to be in the picture. Uh, you might have firearms. You might have some other things that come into play. Sorry about that if this video seems a little bit choppy. I actually... Um Ran out of space on the disc and had to clean it up a little bit before I could continue filming. So the point is being, um, Black Friday is absolutely a great opportunity for preppers to see other people, um, frankly, at their worst. Yeah, um, you know, when you're out on Black Friday, you see all kinds of behaviors that you, you wouldn't expect, or maybe actually you would expect. Um, and it just gives you an idea of what you need to pre be prepared for in an SHTF situation. You know, on Black Friday... You know, if somebody doesn't get their way, are they going to come in, you know, with a little pocket knife, you know, and, and get their way? You know, are they going to stab you? Are they going to pull out a bigger knife? You don't know. Maybe even in the state of Illinois, where we can't carry concealed, but what if they are packing, you know, a 9mm 45 with them? You'll never know. Or what if they get so upset, you know, over a circumstance that they go out to their car and they go get a 12 gauge. These are the kind of behaviors that, you know, that we did see during uh, Black Friday. Not the weapons we didn't see, but we saw people getting very irrational. You need to multiply that by, I don't know, a hundred, a thousand, a million. Not quite sure what the num number is, but we can expect that in an SHTF situation. We saw it in Katrina. Uh, we saw it in other instances in the United States where things... Um, were not, or order was not brought um, up in a timely manner and people really panicked. So that is something we need to be very careful of. Now one of the other things I did want to talk about as you were looking at Cabela's was sales. Um, and I got this, it's, yeah granted it's a, it's not a stellar gun, but it's a 410 uh, single shot there. I got that for 80 bucks. Is that it? Yeah, that's right, at 80 bucks at Gander Mountain. It's a single shot. Um, you know, for me, you know, it's, it'd be good for rabbit hunting, but for 80 bucks, it was very hard to pass up. So, Black Friday, uh, you know, every year seems to amaze me. It taught me a couple things. Number one, there are great sales. Yes, unfortunately, you have to be one of those people in line uh, waiting to get what you want at that discount. And while you're waiting in line, people are going to get fanatic. They're going to get crazy. Uh, that's why when I go out, I make sure I have appropriate EDC with me. Um, no, I can't carry concealed, nor would I ever in the state of Illinois, uh, because they're very strict about the gun laws. But there are other things, you know, the pocket knives, uh, some other EDC I have. If I had to use an emergency situation, I could. Um, so for me, that was a very important one, especially when I'm trying to protect my family members in, in, in lieu of these lunatics out there who, who are absolutely doing... Uh, crazy things because they're not getting their way. So okay, one of the other things I want to show you during Black Friday that we looked at real carefully was um, was some of the ads where we got stuff free, and some of the places we went 
to get free stuff was Walgreens and CVS Pharmacy. And my wife does couponing, so when you look at some of this stuff, most of it, you know, Crest toothpaste, uh, dental floss, Neutralite, Neutralife, I'm sorry, that's some type of vitamin, Thermacare heat pads, Advil, Oral B toothbrushes, um, and a whole bunch of other things. We've got a couple receipts that are just like this. We actually got all of it free, and that's because um, it was on sale, significantly cheap, and my wife used coupons, and in addition, the store gives you um, basically Walgreens bucks, Walgreens money, if you will, and you can use it on your next purchase, which could be that same day, two minutes later, right after your current purchase, but you can use it. And this is really how we get our preps up, is we look for these sales. My wife simply collects the coupons, we use them. We don't always get what we want, when we want, but over time, we've been able to get it all. And this is how really how we built our stockpile. And um, it's worked out well for us, uh, simply because we're patient and we're building up what we need. We only buy, once again, what we use. We are not one of those people who will buy a hundred tubes of toothpaste because we can get it free. We absolutely refuse to do that. Now, if it will go to a good cause or help somebody else, help somebody else out, absolutely we'll do that. So, um, this is just another one of those uh, Black Friday deals that worked out well for us. This is Iron Prepper, just kind of summing it up. Uh, Black Friday is absolutely a great thing because you can get great deals for your preps. Um, but it also gives you a look and insight into how people are going to react um, in a catastrophic, catastrophic event, an SHTF situation, or um, any other situation that, that is going to cause problems for people. So, Zion Prepper signing out, saying thank you, and uh, have a great day.